Good morning children. How are you all? Hope you are all fine. Stay home. Stay safe. Now children, today we are going to start with a new curriculum. Observe your classmates. Yes. Look around. Yes. You have observed everyone now. Are they all same? No, they are all different. Now, every student come from the same place as children. We are all coming from the same place. No, you are all not coming from the same place. Yes, you are all people coming from the different places. But we belong to the same country. But we belong to the same country. So, what is our country name, children? Yes, can anyone guess what is our country name? Yes, what is our country name? India. India is our country. Yes, very good. India is our country. What is our lesson name? Tell me. States and capitals. Our lesson name is States and Capitals. Our lesson name is States and Capitals. Now students, I am going to ask you some questions. Tell me the answers. Radha, get up. Yes. Now, tell me where your aunt live. Yes. What is the auntie name? Shanti. What is her relation? Aunt. Where does she live? Bangalore. State? Karnataka. Which country? Yes, she belongs to India. Next. Raju, please stand up. Yes. Tell me the name of your relative. Ramesh. What is the relation? Uncle. Place where he lives? Vizag. Okay. Vizag is in Andhra Pradesh. Vizag is in Andhra Pradesh. In which country Andhra Pradesh is in? India. It is in India. Now, Sunday, please stand up. Tell your relative name. Yes. Padma. What is the relation? Grandmother. Okay. Which place? Varangal. Where it is? State? Telangana. In which state? Telangana. Where it is? In which country? Again in India. Again in India. See children. Now, 
the name of the relative is shanti what is the relation to you aunt and place where she lives is bengaluru and she lives in which state karnataka state and where is the karnataka is it india only yes very good next ramesh the person name is ramesh what is the relation he is uncle where he lives he lives the place where he lives is vizag in which state it is andhra pradesh in which state it is andhra pradesh in which country india he lives in india only now next padma what is the name of the person padma now the relation is grandmother where she lives in varangal she lives in varangal what is the state name telangana where it is it is in india it is in india they are all lives in india they are all lives in india we people of belongs to india we are all indians we are all indians now children we have different classes in our school isn't it we have different classes in our school like lkg ukg first class second class third class fourth class fifth sixth seventh eighth ninth tenth isn't it your classes from nursery to tenth now only one teacher is taking care of all the classes as children no then who is taking care of all the classes yes different teachers are there different class teachers are there for nursery one teacher lkg ukg like till 10th class till 10th class different teachers are there different different class teachers are there in the same manner in india there are different states and different union territories different states and different union territories now similarly india is a big country india is a big country where one person cannot manage all the states where one person cannot manage all the states now india is the second most populated country in the world india is the second most populated country in the world means it is a big big population very big population is there we stood second in the world which country is the second most populated country children yes india india is the second most populated country in the world it is the seventh largest country it is the seventh largest country in the world means it is a seventh place it stood seventh place in the world seventh largest country in the world it is the seventh largest country in the world children yes india is the seventh largest country in the world each state has one capital how many states are there now 28 states are there in india and 28 capitals each state has one capital state plus capital the country has been divided into smaller parts called states the country has divided india india is a big country na children it has divided into small small parts for the better development because all at a time we cannot do all the things in the country na children so that is the reason they have divided they have divided into small small states na it is divided into smaller states and capitals 28 states are there and 28 capitals there is means children they will take care they will take care with the special rules they have a special rules they have they will just manage with the special rules and the rights in the union territories eight union territories and their capitals now 28 states are there and 28 capitals 
and also eight union territories eight union territories and eight union capitals are there every state has its own capital every state has its own capital how many states are there in india now yes 28 states and how many capitals 28 capitals very good and how many union territories yes eight eight union territories and eight union capitals are there delhi is the capital of india delhi is the capital of india now what is the capital of india children delhi what is the capital of india delhi the president the president the first person of india means who is the first person mr ramnath kovin mr ramnath kovin he is the first person of india na he lives in the delhi in the rashtrapati bhavan the prime minister and the other union ministers the prime minister and the other union ministers and the officials they live in the new delhi now where does the prime minister live children yes the prime minister lives in the new delhi the prime minister lives in the new delhi and where does the president lives where does the president lives he lives in the rashtrapati bhavan he lives in the rashtrapati bhavan yes see this this is the place where the ramnath kovin mr ramnath kovin lives prime minister and who is our president yes who is our ramnath kovin is our president where does he live he lives in the rashtrapati bhavan he lives in the rashtrapati bhavan where it is where is the rashtrapati bhavan yes tell me yes it is in the new delhi rashtrapati bhavan is in the new delhi and also other people the official people the ministers and the other union ministers everyone lives in the new delhi states and capitals of our india how many states are there children yes tell me how many states are there yes there are 28 states and how many capitals are there yes 28 capitals are there andhra pradesh state is andhra pradesh what is the capital amaravati achal pradesh arunachal pradesh capital itanagar assam assam capital dispur bihar capital patna chhattisgarh chhattisgarh capital raipur goa goa capital panaji chhat capital gandhi nagar haryana haryana capital chandigarh himachal pradesh himachal pradesh capital shimla jharkhand jharkhand capital ranchi karnataka karnataka capital bengaluru kerala kerala capital tiruvananthapuram madhya pradesh madhya pradesh capital bhopal maharashtra capital mumbai manipur capital impal meghalaya meghalaya capital shillong 
Mizoram. Mizoram. Capital Aizwal. Nagaland. Nagaland. Capital Kohima. Odisha. Odisha. Capital Bhubaneshwar. Punjab. Punjab. Capital Chandigarh. Rajasthan. Jaipur. Sikkim. Sikkim. Capital Gangtok. Tamil Nadu. Tamil Nadu. Chennai. Telangana. Telangana. Capital Hyderabad. Tripura. Tripura. Capital Agartala. Uttar Pradesh. Uttar Pradesh. Capital Lucknow. Uttarkhand. Uttarkhand. Capital Dehradun. West Bengal. West Bengal. Capital Kolkata. Union territories and the capitals of India. Union territories means children. They have their own rules. They have their own rules and regulations and rights. They have own rules, regulations and rights. Now, Union territories are Andaman Nicobar. Andaman Nicobar Islands. Andaman Nicobar Islands. Capital Port Blair. Capital Port Blair. Chandigarh. Chandigarh. Capital Chandigarh. Capital Chandigarh. Dhara and Nagar Haveli. Dara and Nagar Haveli. And Dhaman and Dhiyu. Dara and Nagar Haveli. And Dhaman and Dhiyu. Capital Dhaman. Capital Dhaman. Delhi. Delhi. Capital Delhi. Capital Delhi. Lakshadi. Lakshadi. Kavarathi. Kavarathi. Puducherry. Puducherry. Capital Pondi Cherry. Capital Pondi Cherry. Jammu and Kashmir. Jammu and Kashmir. Sri Nagar. Capital Sri Nagar. Ladakh. Ladakh. Capital Leh. Capital Leh. In India, children, Rajasthan is the largest state. In India, Rajasthan is the largest state. And Goa. Goa is the smallest state. Goa is the smallest state. There are three water bodies which are surrounded the India. Indian Ocean, Bay of Bengal and Arabian Sea. Indian Ocean. See children, this is the Indian Ocean. This Bay of Bengal. This is the Bay of Bengal. And this is Arabian Sea. These are the three water bodies. Children, can anyone tell me what is called the neighbor? Yes, tell me what is called the neighbor. Yes, next to our house. Next to our house, we'll call it as a neighbor. Next to our house, we'll call it as a neighbor. Whether this side or this side. Whether this side or this side, we'll call it as a neighbor. Or back side of our house or front side of our house, we'll call them as a neighbor. Isn't it? Like that, India is also have a neighboring countries. India is also have a neighboring countries. Now we are going to learn some of the neighboring countries which are 
around the border around the border of our country those are called as a neighboring countries those are called as a neighboring countries afghanistan afghanistan is a neighboring country of india afghanistan is a neighboring country of our india next pakistan pakistan see children it is touching to the border it is touching to the border indian border we will call it as a indian border this border is there na that is a neighboring country pakistan is our neighboring country to the india china china see to the border it is touching to the border it is touching which country is touching china china is touching our border nepal nepal see here again it is touching the border nepal bhutan bhutan this is also touching the border of our country bangladesh bangladesh again it is touching the border of our country next myanmar here myanmar again it is also touching our border see this is our border this is our border myanmar sri lanka sri lanka the small lines the dotted which are touching to our country the small small dotted lines you can see here na yes it is touching to our country sri lanka these are all called as a neighboring countries of our india these are all called as a neighboring countries of our india is yes. the lines you can see over here the the edges these are all called as our neighbors borders these are all called as a borders these are all called it as a borders then capital maps these are the neighboring countries capital map we will learn afghanistan china nepal pakistan bhutan Sri Lanka, Myanmar, Bangladesh. Now you are going to learn some new words. India, I N D I A, India, I N D I A, India. Country, C O U N T R Y. country c o u n t r y country states s t a t e s states s t a t e s states union territories union territories oh, list any sum Okay, practice or list any some states and capitals, whatever you have remembered, whatever you have remembered, list it. I mean, you just write on a piece of paper and get it tomorrow. This is your homework.